welcome, I am the Munchin King of the Century. We have some Floristella! I uh, reacted to one performance by the Bohemian Rhapsody cover, an extraordinary cover of Queen. I must confess to me. Now today's reaction uh, from Susie Kwan. Well, she gave a whole list of, oh, a whole army of things that I could potentially choose from. But I was drawn to their cover of Sound of Silence because I have done two versions of that song on my channel already and the first was the disturbed version very intense very creepy face and the second was the original I believe by Simon and uh, Garfunkel that was very much more stripped back uh, this was a live version I saw, so two very different versions and I suspect we will have a third that's also vastly different. But if I were to guess which of theirs it was most like, I would say the Simon and Garfunkel. But I think it will be a mixture. It will be interesting to discover. Three, two, one, go. My old friend, I come to talk with you again. First of all, we can just right off the bat, we can see the emotion on his face. Look at that. Oh, he's just completely worn out. It's probably quite hot in there, but I mean, you can see that, uh, that, that sadness in his eye. And a very cool jacket, by the way. Because a vision so creepy Let the seas I was sleeping Hearing the other voices coming in. And the vision that was planted in my brain You are Mr. Bass. The music is very stripped back at the moment. I'm sure it will pick up, but it works very well with just their voices. Very different voices, and yet they blend very good and shine their own shine. Sweet voices! Here we are. We're now hearing some uh, little puka! Some nice, gently coming in the music. Well, I'm very glad that they shared their voices with this song because it's going very, very well indeed. No one there, the sound of silence. More layers coming in.
This is different. So that's something that they've added in themselves, I'm pretty sure. What are they saying on these signs that they're holding up? I saw earlier someone had their phone. Uh, is it their name of the group maybe? Or is it something else? There's a lot of that in today's world. People hearing without listening. People talking without speaking. Nonsensical days are we living for sure. Lost to time are these songs. Bravo! Bravo to me! Oh, we are not done here. Oh, this is interesting. I like that gentle high voice and that gentle low voice together. Those two in the middle just stood there like a, like a um, soldiers. Here we are. Very classy behavior. Very professional. Very composed. Um, and they have like a regality about them, their confidence, um, you know they've trained a lot for this. These aren't just taken off the street, classically trained some of them are, if not all of them, as I recall, and it definitely shows. They know how to use their voice, exact precision so they are never at a loss good performance strong flawless as usual i say as usual i only watched one performance of theirs that was flawless bohemian rhapsody um i don't uh, out of the two of them i'll probably say bohemian cover because it had a bit more energy to it um but that's to do with the song itself. Um, so it was interesting to hear this and compare to the other two. As I suspected, this was more like the original Simon and Garfunkel. Except, of course, it caters to the fact that they are a group. There are four of them. And they are classic singers. I don't think Simon or Garfunkel, they were classically trained so we have these nice harmonies and we have their their trained voices uh, showing off um, their gentleness and showing off their richness and it was very funky to me thank you for this request if you want another by uh what's the name of this group uh, by this group then do comment below and do subscribe if you're new and then comment below what you want to see farewell my munchins take care of my munchins <laughs> oh
Thank you.